The new Guinness Premiership season kicks off right here at Twickenham on the 6th of September and promises to be an exciting tournament with Wasp defending their title. With rugby's popularity on the increase, I've come here to catch up with Josh Lucy, James Haskell and Danny Cipriani to get a bit of an insight into the preparations for the new season. Um, yeah, it's been very enjoyable. Um, it's been a good good last week and I think there's been a lot done and a lot achieved. Uh, for me I didn't get to take part too much in the training but for the rehab and, and seeing the physios obviously it's very beneficial for me and I'm up and running again which is very nice. Same for you guys? Yeah I mean it's all right it's always a bit of a shock to the system when you're back uh, back straight away after after holiday I mean we've had two weeks with wasps um, we're back straight into an England camp where Martin Johnson's coming so got to go out there and make sure you impress and, and, and tow the party line really. I think there's uh, some big steps forward I think that Aligned to uh, the developments of, sort of the Guinness Premiership and the, the, the way that the clubs were playing as well. I think that uh, there's an awful lot to be excited about with English rugby, and especially the change in the setup. John has come in, he's a guy who's very much trusted, known by the players, and uh, hopefully we're on the dawn of something which is very, a very exciting time in English rugby. What are your thoughts on how the season will look for Wasps as a team? Well, I think that one of the biggest, our, our biggest challenges is the fact that uh, we've got quite, probably one of the smallest squads in the Premiership, and yet we probably contribute more internationals than anyone else. As such, um, it's one of the most difficult things in terms of finding that balance because we still want to be in the hunt at the end of the season. We're still maintaining a, 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 enough quality uh, when the internationals are away so that you actually continue to pick up, pick up premiership points. Every year when we start again, we, you know, we won the trophy last year in the final. I think this year I'm even more excited by the guys I'm playing with. I mean, obviously when Danny comes back, um, we've got a lot of internationals. I think we've really gelled even, even, even more so. I think people talked about the void that Lawrence um, has left. But to be honest with you, I think we've come closer together. We've got Raf captain, so I'm really excited about playing and, and winning again and, and, and see if we can keep moving this fo team forward without too much of a transition period. It's been a really, really good summer and I think that, um, as I said, you look at the state of the squad, both at Wasps and, and, and England-wise, there's a lot to be excited about this time of the year. Land Rover just announced their a new agreement with the RFU, which is very, very exciting. So everything seems to have been sorted off the field. There are no in-betweens. It means that in terms of the sponsors working with the players, the players working with the coaches, and there are just no excuses now. Everything has been set for, from now the next four, five, six years and, and as I said hopefully with everything off the field being organised uh, it means that the guys can concentrate purely on their jobs and hopefully like James said win and that's, that's why we're here to do is to, is to win games. Thanks very much guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.